I'm Megan. I'm Sierra. And, and we're from the Gymnastics too. Welcome to TC Tuesday. And a lot of you are probably wondering, where's Maggie? So basically, we have a really hectic schedule this week. Yeah. And we couldn't find a time to all get together and film. So we're going to be doing Tuesday's video and then Maggie's going to be doing Friday's video. That way like, you can still see us in a video and then you can obviously still see her video on Friday. This is just how it worked out best. The reason that we didn't have time to film is because um, we're all trying to do a bunch of stuff and then we all leave for California on Wednesday. So to keep this vi this intro kind of short, like we'll explain why later, but today we're going to be doing how to do an aerial. So let's go ahead and get started. Before attempting an aerial, you should already have a solid cartwheel. Now try doing some dive cartwheels. This means that you have to wait a second before putting your hands down. In this clip, you can clearly see that Megan's body is completely off the ground at one point in time. Next, try doing a pop cartwheel. This means you start by doing a normal cartwheel and then as soon as your hands touch, you're going to pull your hands off the ground. Now try combining the pop and dive cartwheel so your hands are on the ground for as little time as possible. Now we're going to add a hurdle, which means that you're going to just step into the scale and bring your leg up. Then take the hurdle and add the dive pop cartwheel to it. For your aerial, it's important that you have a really good set, so here are two sets that you can try out. The purpose of the set is to help give you momentum, so make sure that when you're setting, you use your arms to actually help you do the scale. The next rule is to help you get your leg around, because it's really important if you want to do your aerial, you need to have your leg go up fast. So just hurdle into a wall and get your leg up as fast as you can. This will help you in your aerial, because you need to have your leg go fast around, so that way you don't put your hands down. Now you should start going for your aerial. If you have a sweet spot or any bouncy surfaces, you should definitely try that first, like a trampoline. You can also have someone spot you. First, have them spot you on a car wheel and then have them grab your hips when you're doing the aerial and make sure they're pulling you up so you don't need to put your arms down. If for some reason you can't land your aerial, maybe you need more power. So something that helped me figure out this problem was by making sure I pushed off my back foot and then my front leg first. This gave me a lot more power so I was able to be up higher and land my aerial better. If you're really close to your aerial, but you for some reason keep putting your hands down, try this little trick. Hold some objects like we have some scrunchies, but any other small objects will do, and try doing your aerial while holding the objects, and you're going to be less likely to put your hands down. Those are all the tips we have for this aerial tutorial. Hopefully you guys get your aerial soon. Good luck. So now it's the end of the video, we can explain what we're doing in California. So we are going to go to VidCon in California this year. Uh, it's really exciting. We are going as guests, but we do get to go on the Awesomeness TV stage for 20 minutes. Yeah, we'll so. be going on stage July 24th, 12 o'clock until 12.20. Um, we'll be doing a Q&A and also some different challenges. So make sure you guys subscribe to TC2 Extras because we will be vlogging our experience in California. And it'll be super fun. We're super excited to be able to go. And if you guys are going to go to VidCon as well, let us know in the comments below and maybe... Maybe you'll see us we'll there. See you there. We'll be tweeting a whole bunch of stuff like during VidCon, like where we're at and stuff. So you also want to make sure you're subscribed. I mean, not subscribed. You're following our, all of our social media, and that'll keep you updated. And make sure you guys enter our giveaway as well. Yeah, and this Friday. So get on that if you haven't entered it. Um, thanks for understanding why we had to film separate videos this week. Uh, we didn't want to take a week off, so this we was just thought this was the best idea. Yeah. Um, anyways, we hope you guys like this video. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel down below. And we will see you on Flipping Friday. Well, actually, Maggie will. Yeah. Bye. Bye.